hello guys welcome back to the channel today we are solving another lead code problem that is 1081 so smallest subsequence of distinct character before jumping into the solution i would highly recommend you should read the problem statement on your own and give at least 15 to 30 minutes to this problem so let's get right into it what problem is asking that you need to return the smallest lexiographical subsequence of s and if you don't know what is the subsequence subsequence mean if you are given a string for example this and if you delete this 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 whatever you delete but you do not change the ordering that is subsequence and lexicographically smallest means if this is and if this the smallest will be a c d because a is less than b that's very much it so let's see let's take a test case and understand if you if you have read this problem there is something that you should always take in your consideration is that it, it can should contain all the distinct character of x s not x s exactly once need to contain every distinct character why it is written because if there are many a's you can keep taking all the a's so that's not the case you cannot take all the a's you have to take everyone and also it implies also it implies another thing what that if this character is not present at back if it is present only at that place you have to take it no matter what even if it means that it is not the smallest what i'm trying to say is that you take a okay you take c now when you go to t what should we do d is only one he is not the duplicate so we have to take it no matter what even if it is not the smallest and also we have taken a and c we cannot take again c not c only thing that left is b and why we take didn't take in b at the starting because we have b at the end so we can take the chance that take the chance of making the smallest number not number the subsequence so that much is very clear that you have to take everyone if something is present and something less than that is present you can ignore the one that you have taken before because you can take it afterwards that much is very clear okay and also duplicate should not be present that much is very clear and also one thing let's take example 3124 using these four digit you have to make the smallest number what you can do is one two three four this is the smallest number so the one thing should be taken uh, should be noted that is that in order to get the minimum number you need to have everyone in increasing order but here something should be in your mind that it is a subsequence you cannot change the order like here what we did you cannot change the order but this thing is very true that you need to have everyone in increasing order and and if you if you do this thought in your mind if you run this thought in your mind for two three times something should have struck in your mind that we need to do this in o of n or o of or n log n and we need to take the decision of increasing and if you have done enough lead code you know what is the best data structure that we can use is monotonic stack because this will be the thing that that will make our algorithm fit in o of n or n log n but our running time is o of n 
this is the thing because push and pop o of one that much is very clear what we are doing is increasing order no order change no duplicate and thing is take even if doesn't make have no not have doesn't make smallest why because we don't have the choice of taking it again this happens this this happens when it is single single character present in the duplicate in the duplicate case when it is duplicate you can have it afterwards if some better some if some better choice is currently present what do i mean by better choice if we have d in the stack and if d is still present after uh, d is still present in the string after that we have a we will just pop it and take a so now let's move to our algo algo is already discussed mostly we take we have to take care of the duplicate so so for that we have we have we have to make a scene vector that it is already present and we have to make the frequency vector of characters why why to have this if it is present in somewhat in the future then we can take that better option in the present to have that computation to have that freedom we need that frequency and why scene also discussed now now it's very basic monotonic stack question just iterate iterate over the over the input and while iterating you have to take care of something what is this st dot empty we why we do this because we are accessing st dot top in the first iteration when the top is empty so that's why st dot top uh, current and also also what we would be checking is the frequency of st dot top why because we cannot pop it if it is not present in the future because we need to take everyone that is the case and if we pop it while popping it what we have to do we have to make scene of that top is equals to zero and pop it because because if you do not make it scene zero then we will not be able to take it in the future that's the case and this is the this is the this is the first step this is the middle and this is the last step that will happen in any of the case pushing the current and also making the scene of current one because we have taken it inside the stack so no more taking it in the future so that's is that's the very much the algo it is now let's take the test case 
I have explained enough but still give as many as chance so that you can make some intuition and understand see D D what it is D C B C B C C B C what is the frequency how many C's four how many A's one how many B's two how many D's first C will be in the stack again when B appears B is the smallest if C is present in the future yeah it is present my bad I just forgot to decrease it if C is present in the future yeah it is present pop it no worries push B now we are at A if B is present in the future if B is present in the future yeah it is present pop it I'm just forgetting every time to decrease it now when we are at C at again when we at C again what to do push it because increasing order at D what to do push it increasing order C is smallest than the what to do again C again C will not be pushed because it is seen already. C is seen already. Again. B. It will be pushed. It will be pushed. Why? Why it will be pushed? Because D doesn't have any future so we have to keep it so anyways we will push it again c seen already no need to push it we have our answer if you do this if you use a stack stack like this you need to take it inside the you need to take this inside a string and then reverse it string and then reverse it or if you take if you take a string only instead of stack you can just return this so that much is very clear now let's go to the coding part yeah yeah here we didn't take stack we take took string discussed seeing the frequency making the frequency vector and just iteration decreasing the frequency vector if it is seen continue it because no nothing to be computed because it is already in the stack and if and if something is less than current present if something is less than the top and also if it is present in the future then make it unseen and pop it and push the current push the current and make it seen because it is in the stack and after all that hustle was hustle just return the stack you can take stack of character as discussed or you can take even a string that should be very much clear only thing changes is instead of talk top you can take back and instead of pop you have to do pop back that much is the difference you can see for yourself how much fast it is running 100% clap for me so that's it uh, if I was able to make you understand the intuition and you got something to learn so please consider subscribing to the channel and liking this video you have to do what you have to do so keep grinding and you guys are awesome see you in the next one bye bye